Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Observer. I've recently played through Layers of Fear and I decided that I was going to look into some of the other games that Looper something SA, I can't remember the name of the publisher now, but I, it seemed interesting, especially with all the hype from Cyberpunk. Apparently my headphones are ridiculously loud right now, hang on. There we go. So, let's just jump into it. It's cyberpunky. It's about a detective who can access the minds of people and find their memories. Zuzarski, you there? Hmm. Come in, Lazarski. Lazarski, oh. you there? We're getting weird, like, pixelized. I thought that was my capturing software being Come weird, but no, we're getting pixelization in our view. Yeah, I'm here. You okay there? I've been hailing you for the past five minutes. I'm fine. I must have dozed off. No rest for the wicked. How's the dream meter treating you? Well, I'm not a vegetable yet. Could have fooled me. Hardy heart. I'm serious, Dan. Your signal's all over the place. Have you taken your meds? Meds? Yeah, don't worry about it. I will, in a moment. <laughs> Do it now. I need you in good shape. Middle mouse button to stick the status and you synchronizing something. Very dapper looking fellow, isn't it? Gender A1. Yes. It's doing something. Does it stabilize my vision and things? Thank Aha, you, it has. Looking better already. Yeah. Wouldn't want me to mess up. Can you see the headlines? Another leech goes berserk. Don't be like that. It's just... Yeah, yeah. Uh, have you got any work What's for me? What's this about? Just checking in, or you need me downtown? Nah, just What's a checkup. No one left for you to interrogate. It sounds pretty bad. Yep, it's not pretty. The explosion leveled half a block. The place is still on fire. Corporate goons all over the place, securing the area. Covering your tracks, you mean? Uh... Careful what you say. This is a monitor channel. Who is this? How'd you get this frequency? My face looked different Don't in the mirror. recognize me? Adam? Yes. Well, what's left of me? Dad? Oh. What happened? Where, where have you been all this time? Away from you? <laughs> it's funny. Thought it would be easier. To hear your voice after all these years. But... It really isn't. Come on, Adam. Don't start. <laughs> I really thought I could pull it off. You know? I was so close. To making a difference. To setting us all free. And now it's... Can't be for nothing. It doesn't matter. Tell me where you are. I'll come and get you. Shit. Dad. For once in your life, just listen to me. Whatever happens, I need you to remember. You're not in control. Adam. Can you hear me? You still there? Adam. God damn it. Dad? Dad. Matriarch, display caller ID. Displaying now. Krabinski. That's no. Matriarch, locate source of last call. Triangulating coordinates. Come on. Location established. Tenement building. Class C district. Jesus. Adam, the stacks. You just had to hit bottom, huh? Rock fucking butter.
this seems like it's going to be very interesting indeed. It's a very strange mixture of super looper team. I was right, that wasn't it. A super a mix between old stuff like cassette players and old cars and super high-tech modern cybernetics and things. I think this is going to be really interesting concept. I don't know if it's going to be a scary game or if it's just going to be a weird thriller sort of game. I'm not entirely sure. Well, I guess I'll find out. Hopefully there's not too many puzzles that I'll just spend the entire game getting stuck on. Because, uh, if you've watched anything else, you know that I'm not a very smart man when I'm recording videos. <laughs> a very funky looking intro sequence. I get a feeling this is going to be a little bit scarier than I think it's going to be. Very well made so far. <laughs> I believe this came out after Layers of Fear. And Layers of Fear was a very enjoyable game to play through. So I'm hoping this is a similar. If this is even partly as good as Layers of Fear, it would be very interesting. I do like cyberpunk stuff. <laughs> Ooh. We in control yet? Yes, we are. What is this? That's some weird overlay. So what's the hang on, wasn't this? Overworked, don't lose your head. The new Pollux personal computer is both powerful and user-friendly. Catch your breath. Spend some time with your family. Let your electronic counterpart share the load. I'll take one. Can it talk into a microphone and record gameplay? Bloody hell. Are you hoovering me? Look, friend. I definitely need one of those. Can I press the button on the side of his head? No. Can I get ahead of myself here? I'm just kind of looking around. Oh, hello. What are you? Need to get out. Easy there, Tin Man. I'm not looking for trouble. Oh. No. Detective. I don't live in this dump, if that's what you're ah, asking. That's not the response. Stay here, our business. <laughs> I'm leading an investigation. KPD. Stay here, our business. I just did. One of your tenants is my business. Huh. Lame. I don't remember. Lazarusky? Rabinsky? Oh, this is going to be one of those games where I really need to pay attention to what's going on, isn't it? I think it was Grabinsky. Grabinsky. Leon Grabinsky. Tenant. Oh. Oh. Apartment 7. Uh, oh, ground floor. Through the courtyard. Turn right, turn left. Straight ahead, turn right. You're yeah. about to find out how bad I, I am. Back with him forward. Thanks. Mm, door open. You're about to find out how bad I am at following directions. Number seven. That. The Polymath 31A, the state-of-the-art holographic display, offers virtual reality-grade immersion. The mighty processor will handle even the most complex calculations. The kinetic interface allows for maximum comfort and efficiency. Can we get in? Ah, no we can't. But the Krato, impeccable sound recording quality, even under the harshest of conditions. I love the fact it's got, like, that's... 80s or like early early technology get out of the way the tattoo gun laser precision stellar performance out of this world quality down to earth price can we no okay, so it's got the same sort of 
controls of layers of fear. What is with this weird overlay of everything? Citizens. Oh, hello. Curfew is now in effect in all Class C districts. Remain in your apartments and enjoy your chosen holographic content. Thank you for your cooperation. Oh, that's a very nice advert. Okay. Through the courtyard, turn. Right then, left. Let me just have a quick look around. Oh no, I can feel a sneeze. I refuse to have a sneeze recorded on my channel. Must control. Uh, okay. Number seven. Oh, it's that one. Please have numbers on doors. One to 17. Seems good. Aha! One! Are we going any of these or...? Well, I don't know what that is. What in the name of hell was that noise? That doesn't seem like a normal thing to be hearing. That's the water closet. Is every door in this blasted place locked? What is that? Whatever it is I wanted. Recharge your battery. Let the invigorating force fl throw, flow through you. A unique blend of sugar and stimulants will keep your mind and body going. Yes, give me one right now. Four, five. Got a red light on it. It's gotta be around here some. Where? That doesn't seem like a sanctioned wall building. But... Okay, here we are. Let's open her up. Uh, there's no doorbell, so we're just gonna walk in. Let's ring it. Press control to crouch. I can crouch through here, but I can't get through here. Oh wait, I can interact with the bookcase. That is a very nice jacket. Oh. I really hope you guys can see. I, uh, I increased the brightness. I noticed my laser field was a bit dark. Oh, his head's gone. That idea, the headless corpse. Breathe, you idiot. Mild sedative. Dispatch, this is Azowski, ID 656210. Can anyone hear me? Great. Fucking great. Okay, Dan. Maybe it's not him. Doesn't have to be. Operational efficiency restored. Only a headless corpse. This is Fine. 656210. Setting up a crime scene. Press E to activate electromagnetic vision. I need to check the victim's Whoa. compass for connections. Is that the compass or is that the compass? Oh, compass. Victim is equipped with an ID mixer. Identification not possible. Damn it. Illegal software detected. Unlicensed hardware detected. HN. Gotta start somewhere. Okay. Consumer grade communication device. Illegal modification detected. Heavy encryption. What is that? Six million volts wasn't enough. Wow. Pretty powerful. So. Q is biovision. Wow, this is cool. Okay, well his head's missing. The head was removed post mortem. Oh, post mortem. Killer took it. Motive unclear. 
Yeah, post mortem, which means it happened after his death. Erratic cutting pattern, indicating the killer was in a frenzy. ID check failed. Time of death about an hour ago before he called me. Assuming it's him. Oh yeah, before he called. So. Can't be him. Species Homo sapien. Okay. Contaminants detected. Failed to extract forensic data. Can I turn off the... See if we can find anything else. Oh, making my eyes go funny. Printed on real paper. Oh, a little archaic for you, Adam. Hey, there's nothing wrong with a... Good book. 1984, George Orwell. Classic book. Hey, hello, what's that? Bunch of processors? The Serisync 7. I don't think this has any uh, holding on the story, but who knows. I wonder if I can interact with them even without the vision. I think I can, so... I need to find the weapon, right? Oof. Whoever hit that without a bad day, didn't they? Oops. Oh, I always press escape when I don't need to. Okay. Is there anything in here? Yes. Whatever this is. Oh, it's uh... Adam, uh, so this is your apartment. Doesn't mean... It's your body. Why is the face blurred out? How bizarre. I don't know why we turn the fan on, but you never know. Bingo. Let's show up in the... I don't know, I found it on my own. Enter a code. Damn it. What was the... Where would we get a code from? Well, this picture had some numbers on it. By 2068. No figures. You were never <laughs> sentimental. I mean, the fact, the fact that they put that in there, makes me very happy. We can hack it by pressing the middle mouse button, apparently. But I would quite like to see if we can work out what it is. It's uh, George Orwell, 1984. Eighty-four. Uh, hey! Uh. Cool. What the hell is this? Other than amazing, I want one right now. I want a big a platform to come down behind me, right in my room. That'd be brilliant. Okay, what we got? Apparently now this is a thing. I would say that it's been ignored. Well, we have this. A glitch in the system. A brief history of the nanophage. There was a scrolling text at the start of this game uh, that explained what was going on in the world. Uh, it may have something to do. It talked about the nanophage. Something to do with uh, cybernetics. Going bad. Downtown Inferno. Tragic accident or insurgent attack. So we, this appears to be a personal computer, which is very, very cool. They know. Listen, I know you're a busy man and all, but we gotta talk. Now. I think they're onto me. For real this time. I'm almost certain someone followed me home yesterday. And today, I saw this weird guy outside my window. Just standing there. If you can't guarantee my safety, then I'm out. I've got enough problems as it is. H.M. 
this is a reply to an email called Complications. As far as our little meal goes, don't worry. I can manage her. She's not like us. She knows she's in over her head and it clearly terrifies her. You can't expect too much from a simple mind. For now, just focus on your work and leave the human relations aspect of our project to me. For the time being, calm down and maintain focus. Eyes on the prize, Jay. P.S. Glad you like the piece. I think it captures the essence of what we're trying to accomplish. Scroll, apparently. There we go. Okay, emergency services are still on the scene after an immense explosion to a hole in what was a once serene business area of downtown Krakow. The blast is now thought to have originated at the Chiron Incorporated Research and Development Center. Although a joint search effort has been launched by the KPD and corporate personnel, the rescue teams scouring the site are yet to find any survivors among the rubble. The exact number of casualties is yet to be calculated, but according to our sources, no high-ranking Chiron official was injured in the tragic event. <laughs> That's typical. As to what caused the explosion, early reports suggested a reactor malfunction, but a corporate executive who wishes to remain anonymous had his own ideas on the subject. We are not excluding anything at this point, but this has terrorist written all over it. It is precisely the sort of cruel and cowardly tactics the anti-republican insurgents excel at. We'll have an official statement on the matter shortly. If the insurgents were indeed behind this vicious attack, their goals remain a mystery. The Centre conducted civilian research focusing primarily on development of new and improved neural links and other consumer products. It seems that whatever third party was involved, their sole purpose was to wreak havoc and destruction, striking fear into the hearts of the public at large. When asked to comment, Police Inspector Robert Hikula gave a prompt and stern reply. Chiron executives have provided their full support in dealing with the situation. He then retreated to his squad car, clearly distraught by the events of the day. We will bring you more on this story as it develops. Okay, so some terrorists have probably attacked a Chiron executive place. Interesting. There's some documents here. Corrupted data. Corrupted, corrupted, corrupted. So they're all corrupted. Home security? I've deactivated the apartment security system, leaving the crime scene. Ooh, okay. Was that my goal? <laughs> now, did anything else happen to be here? What is, hang on, what is that? Synchrozine collected. Ooh, synchrozine, okay. That's the stuff that stops me going mad, right? Take enough of that. As much of that is humanly possible. Uh, anything over here? I don't think so. I think we're good. I think I can now leave. Ah, I see he rerouted the security to a different pad. That makes a lot of sense. Alright then, let's leave the apartment. This just doesn't feel right. You're still alive. I know it. Balls. Everything is locking down. This is a sanctioned lockdown procedure. There is no need for concern. Remaining in the apartment. Oh, not the dreaded sparks, not again. Oh, my. A bird. <laughs> it's like I'm walking into a wall. I am walking into a wall. How did the birds get in here? What the hell? What's this? What's the wall closet? Well, somehow I don't think there's going to be anything in the toilet. Somehow. You never know. Check behind the door. No, I don't actually know what I'm trying to achieve right now. He says something about case logs. Do I have a case log? Aha! Option, investigate the crime scene. Identify the call. A compass ID was H and N. Option, interrogate neighbors. Okay, okay. 
Uh, we still have citrazine or whatever it's called. Well, let's interrogate. Can we talk to number six? I mean, this right here. Hi, this is Tom. Hi, Tom. And Irene. <laughs> we hope you're having a positively peachy day. Oh, we sure do. Sadly, no. we're not in right now. Oh, okay. <laughs> what a you shit. You can leave your message after the beep, and we'll get back to you as soon as we're home. Yay! Oh, I mean, beep! Ha ha. Ha 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 ha. I don't like people like that. Hang on, what was the name? H&R, right? H&N, sorry. H -N. Well, we can't get into eight, so let's try. Oh, sorry, six. Let's try eight. What? What do you want? Got a minute, sir. KPD. Oh God, they're here! The cleaners are here! The cleaners? I right, tell, sir. Who are the cleaners? Okay, well, eight's out of the book. Nine? Might as well do this logically. KPD, I need to talk to you. You broke it! No, you broke it! Nuh-uh! Bunch of kids? Get these kids to shut up! I'm fucking talking here! Yeah, what's this about? Uh... Do you know the tenant in Portman 7? Dad, Tommy's picking on me! Shut up, snitch. I thought I told you to shut up! Seven, huh? Nah, can't say that I know the guy. Okay, so it's a guy. Yeah, well, seen him once or twice. I might have a vague recollection. Could you give me a vague description? Maybe. What's it to you? Uh, he might be my son. He has kids. He may he may roll with that one. My son might have been staying in that apartment. I'm trying to find him. Well, why don't you tell me what he looks like? I'll let you know if it rings a bell. We lost touch. It's uh. been a while. Huh. Sign of the times, I guess. See, I'm a family man myself. You shut up. No, you shut up. No. I swear, if you don't shut up this instant... Uh, yeah, I can tell. So, <laughs> can you describe him or what? Young, probably in his 20s. Medium height, medium built. He wasn't very memorable. Uh, was there anything suspicious? Have you seen anything suspicious around the building? Any strangers skulking around? Nah. I don't pay much attention to the other tenants. Bunch of losers. A lot of... You are so dumb. Not as dumb as you are. Nuh-uh. You're way dumber. Shut the fuck up! Not upstanding citizens like you. You bet your ass. Good thing we'll be getting out of this dump soon. Is that right? Yep. I've been working my way up. I even filed for a status upgrade. Once that goes through, we'll be moving to a B-class district in no time. Yeah, good luck with that. That wasn't helpful at all. All that did was make me happy that I don't have any brothers or sisters. Uh, I think we got time for one more. Should we see if we can talk to the person in ten? Yeah, we can. Nobody home. Okay. These holes in walls are very bizarre ways of uh, making more room in apartment buildings. There's a lockdown in effect, so I'm assuming I can't hey, leave. Come here, quick! What is it? What's up with the lockdown? Is it the phage? Was there an outbreak? Uh, no. A malfunction, more likely. You would say that, wouldn't you? To keep us at bay until the cleaners come. Uh, oh God, they're coming for me. 
I don't want to die. Calm down. No one's coming. I'm guessing if the cleaners come, they just set fire to everything and kill everybody to contain the, uh, contain the death. Either way, I think I'm going to have to end the episode here. Uh, we've achieved nothing, but this seems like a very interesting game. It seems like I'm going to be trying to piece together a mystery from talking to various different people. So we'll see how smart I'm feeling. Don't hold your breath. I might require some help on this one. But either way, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Your comments are greatly appreciated, especially on the first episode of any series. It's really helpful if people show me how much they like it. But either way, I'll see you next time.